Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna help you fix the YouTube your offline error. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, let's go over to YouTube. If you tap on YouTube and you're trying to watch, say, a video on YouTube, but it's saying there's you know no connection or you're offline, there are a few different things that we can do to get that working again for you. So let's head out of here and let's open up Safari or Google Chrome. And we'll go to Google and just type in speed test here. So if it's saying that you're offline, you just, the first thing that you wanna do is of course, just check and make sure that you have a good and fast internet connection. Now, if this is anything more than, you know, a couple of megabytes per second, then you do have an internet connection and it shouldn't be giving you that your offline error. If it does, you know, crawl and it's really slow to open up pages and everything, you can swipe down from the top right and you can always toggle off your Wi-Fi and switch from Wi-Fi over to cellular data. Sometimes that's faster and sometimes that works a little bit better um, to be able to use YouTube and, and not to say that you're offline. Now, if that works fine, the second thing we'll do is make sure that YouTube servers are not down themselves and that's the reason why you're not able to watch any videos. So let's type in, is YouTube down right here? And then go to down detector. And you can see I scroll down and there's no, no real big huge spike in reports that YouTube is down. So in this regard, that's probably not an issue. If you see a massive spike in YouTube reported outages, then likely YouTube servers are out. And that could be the reason why it's saying that you're offline and not able to watch any videos. Now, the very last thing that you can do now that we've checked your internet connection and we've checked the YouTube servers is to head into settings here and you'll see a page like this and then we'll get into general and then we'll get into iPhone storage. And you'll just wanna scroll down until you find YouTube and you can tap offload this app and then reinstall the app. And what this does is it replaces and reinstalls the core YouTube files and that kind of resets everything and refreshes everything. It doesn't log you out. It doesn't kind of remove any of your comments or anything that you've done on YouTube itself. But this is a good way to kind of reset the app so that you can get back in here and make sure you're able to watch any kind of videos. And it doesn't say that you're offline for whatever reason. So once that's done loading, we can open it up and watch our videos. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.